hello guys it's me the inside man from tech brand and in this video i'm going to be showing you guys how you can easily share file from your apple iphone to your android device or with your windows laptop the apple ecosystem in bu is built in such a way that iphones can only communicate with other iphones easily and with their macbook pros or ipad but then if you want to share your file from your iphone to an android or to your windows laptop there's an easy way to go about it first you need to be connected to the internet and then you go to your apple app store then download the google drive app then you have to sign in a jimmy it can be you can sign in the new jimmy when you open the google the drive the google drive app or you can already use you can use an existing email that is in the phone and you just connect to the jimmy whichever works fine now once that is done what you have to do is you go back to the location of your file on your in your iphone now when you go back to the location of the file what you do is you open the file then you click on the share button when you click on the share button from the list of share options you will see the drive now select the drive app that you just downloaded now a couple of options will come up you can decide to switch whichever if you have more than one email if you have multiple gmails you can switch which of the gmail you'll be uploading the file to or you can also select the folder you want the file to be in in the specific gmail set you can just upload to the root folder of the drive you can also create a new folder clicking the folder icon at the top close to the search icon you click and you name the folder then you upload in that folder this way it makes it looks easier for you to just organize your files in the folder and make and know exactly where the new file is once that is done you click on upload the file will start uploading in the google drive now once that is done like i said you must be connected to a network it might be your cellular network or your home wi-fi whichever works fine now once that is done you now have to go to your google device or your windows device now for this case i'll be using my android now when you go to the android what you do is you go to your drive if you already have the drive application in your android in most cases it's always there you just have to download go to the google play store and download the drive the google drive application now once that is done you have to sign in the gmail the one on your android on your iphone rather you sign it in on your android phone if you have lots of gmail just select uh, the gmail from your android device then look for the folder in the drive then select the file you want to download and click on the download button from the list of options now once you click on the download button you will see the file will actually download to your android device now you can go to folder and you will see the file and downloads this works for file any file size and for any file type another thing is you can also actually download this from the google drive website just go drive.google.com which means if you have a laptop you can sign in your gmail in your laptop your windows laptop then go to a web browser in your laptop then go to drive.google.com and when you go there you will be able to actually switch in between uh, whichever email the one you want the one in your apple iphone then you will see all the files that are uploaded in the drive there so you can just click on the home button if the if you enter the url is not taken to the home like mine is not on the home, home of the drive right now so i'll just click on the home button in my top left in the top left corner and when i click on the home it will take me to all the files in the home so there is a little option for you to toggle between files and folder i will just click on folders that will see the folder that uh, i just downloaded I, I uploaded from my apple iphone you can see the folder there now I open the folder and then i will see the file uh, inside the folder so i can just click on the options the three dots to my right then i'll see the options to download and i download and is in my windows so guys this is how to transfer file from your iphone to your windows or um, android phone is me the inside man don't forget to subscribe to this channel and like the video i'll see you guys on the next one bye for now